Hey guys, it's Nick here, and today we're going to be playing Clash Royale. Today we're going to be playing this deck that I saw in a classic challenge that this guy was playing that is very, he's very good. He's 460th in, in the world, and he's number one in his clan. Actually, no, he's not. Never mind. But he's still very good, so we're going to be playing this deck right here. It's a hog rider, but a good bit of splash with the tornado. So we're going to be playing it in this classic challenge to show you guys how the deck works. Let's see what we can do right here. So good luck to this guy. I'm just gonna play a hog ice spirit off the start. I'm just gonna log that goblin barrel right there. He's gonna play an infernal tower, so that's just that's gonna take on my hog. So that's pretty much a we both cancelled each other's push. But I'm down one elixir. So now we're just gonna wait to see what he plays and then we're gonna react to what he plays. Or I'm just gonna actually yeah, I'm gonna react to what he plays. Doesn't look like he's gonna play anything, so we're just wait. He's gonna play princess, I'm gonna play musketeer right there. Okay, we're gonna take that out, we're gonna play anything else to defend on musketeer. We're gonna play Gomi Gang, play a baby dragon, play an ice spirit right there. I'm gonna go on a hog push with my baby dragon. Dragon, maybe try to go in the front, then I'll play my hog rider. Nice, he doesn't. Oh, how did that inferno get in? How did, how did he get an inferno in rotation? How did he even play it? I was extremely lucky right there. And now I'm just gonna play a bowler in the back. Oh, anyway, the bowler got it. So even though we missed our log, the bowler's still gone. So that was a good play to play the bowl in the back right there. He's gonna play another princess, so I'll, I'm gonna play my baby dragon. I'm just gonna wait right now. I'm gonna play in the back. He's obviously gonna let them well play. Then I'm gonna play ice cream. Push. Don't quite have my lane. I'm not gonna get that. My minor should just go and die. The baby dragon gonna get some good damage. I. I mean, we didn't take any damage, but that was a misplay. I'm gonna play my log. It's okay, it was a misplay. But it was okay after all. Anyway, now we can log this pretty good. And uh, his minor to my king tower right there. And he played a poison, so that was a positive trick. Anyway. So my he's gonna split Gully Gang in the back. Uh, I'm thinking to go on a hog push right here. So I'm gonna play Baby Dragon and Ice Spirit. Nice, that was fine. Damage. So right here I'm gonna go to Hog Rider. I have my lightning ready for now, right here. I'm gonna play his Inferno Tower, I'm gonna lightning that. I cannot quite hit that princess, so I'm just gonna let that princess go. That hog's gonna get two hits right there. My my baby dragon's gonna keep getting some damage off. Also, I'm gonna log that princess right there. I'm gonna get ready with another hog push. When I get a not enough to Cancel that golem barrel with my tornado. He played that inferno early, so I'm just going to right there. Oh, yeah. He made me just need one more light. Came close, but not quite. Not quite enough. So that's really the So we keep going. So your main push is obviously the lightning, uh, the lightning hog rider and ice spirit. But if you need a support troop in it, that's very good. It's very defensive. He's gonna play a miner. I'm gonna log that right there. I was thinking of maybe turning that miner, but I was not able because it was on, on the outside. So right here, I'm just gonna go for it. Minor. We're seeing a lot of minor poison today. Ah, I think I'm maybe lightning that. Now I'm just gonna get two hits right there. That's good. I'm gonna play a dragon. I'm gonna pull that bone barrel to my feet. And that scarmid's not gonna do any damage on the top. 
that's very good right there. We're up and down. I feel like we're up on Elixir too, he's been a good bit. Gombro um, right there. He mirrored his Gombro. That's good to know. From here, I could just keep playing defense and just lighting at the end. So I'm playing ice break right there. Make sure we don't keep any Very good trade for us right there. And nice. It's gonna even get on the tower, so it's gonna make it a long range, log range even. So I'm, I'm just gonna let that miner go, honestly. It, it really helps with that king tower shooting on it, so it's really gonna minimize the damage it's gonna do. So now I'm just gonna keep playing defense. There's no need for me to go on another to try to get a second tower. There is absolutely no need. I'm just gonna stay on defense. Is he maybe gonna try to push on the right side, but that would just be a waste. I'm still gonna try this. He mirrored him. Okay, well that's a waste. Okay, there's no elixir right now. I'm gonna log that. we probably gonna win the trade. It's easy. I'm even gonna put a hog rider in ice, but just to keep the pressure up. Because he's down a lot of elixir. He played a minion and then he mirrored him. I don't know why he did that. Really. He's down a good bit of elixir right here. There's no way he can come back. There is no way, because I can take out his minion with my baby dragon and with my tornado. If we would add heal, the deck would have been better, but except for that, it's not too, too good, honestly. I'm just going to put him in the right lane in case he wants to push on that side, but there's really nothing he can do. Just going to turn the lane over there. We're just going to, that's going to be it. I'm going to log that. And that should be game right there, so good game for this guy. Can you get a second tower, maybe? No, no, no. Of course. That's good game to this guy. There we go. We didn't have a defense. That was a little bit hard for me. Two battles right there. Oh, playing against John Cena. I have the hog off the start, so I'm just gonna send the hog in. I would have liked to have my ice rate, but just send the hog in to see what he has. That's good though, he spent five elixir for my four. So I'm up one right there. Gonna play Musketeer. He's gonna play an Ice Golem. He's gonna play Graveyard. So that's why I didn't want to play my Baby Dragon. In case he's gonna play Graveyard. That Electro Wizard is gonna get a couple shots off, but we should still be okay. Yeah, we're okay. He's gonna play an Executioner. I don't wanna have to play my Baby Dragon it's so quick, but I'm gonna have to because I don't wanna set out Electro. He's saying, oops. I don't know why. I don't know why. I'm trying to play a boy right there. Um, I'm just gonna I'm thinking of tornadoing that, but we do need. Baby Dragon's still alive, doing a great job. He keeps saying, oops. But I think he's wasting a good bit of elixir. Bad bowler is targeting the um, executioner, so actually I'm gonna right, that right there. So we're gonna hit that Inferno Tower and that uh, Electro Wave. So my bowler should get onto the tower right here. That should be some interaction. It's not getting on time, unfortunately, but. Uh, it might get one shot. It might. Nah, it's gonna die. He's gonna play that, so I'm just gonna play it. I'm gonna log that uh, battle ram right there, and it should not get. Eh, that. I don't know. That, uh, that barbarian's gonna get two shots off. So, surprisingly enough, he's gonna lead in damage. Actually, I'm gonna go with a hog and an ice pit to keep the pressure up. Because I have a support troop in the musketeer to help. So that musketeer should take out that executioner and my hog can get one, two, three hits right there. So that's very good for us. I'm gonna play a bowler right there. Ah, that bowler wasn't really needed, honestly. The executioner was gonna die anyway on his own. Yeah, that wasn't a good play. But it's okay, we're gonna take him out anyway. It's okay. We're gonna take him out anyway. I'm just gonna go let that bowler go and die. I'm just gonna play musketeer in the back. Sorry. A push up. So we're gonna play that. I'm gonna play battle ram. Tornado and I'm gonna log it, I'm gonna play Ice Spear to make sure we take that out. He's gonna send an Electro, so I'm gonna play a Bowler right there. I'm gonna send a Hog right over there. Nice, that Musketeer took that out, and she's still gonna be alive. She's gonna be able to help, but we'll put another Inferno Tower, so that's okay. 
right there. He said he spent a lot of this on the map, but we didn't, so that's cool. I'm gonna log that. I'm gonna send the ice spirit right there. Freeze that. Play baby dragon. I'm gonna get ready with my hog lightning. That hog, that lightning, uh, an infernal tower is really on the left, so we might be able to, to, uh, to pass it. But yeah, we are. But it's still gonna hit. I'm sitting at full. I tried the lightning, but I didn't get enough value. So I did. Uh, I don't want lightning. I just didn't seem good enough. For the amount of elixir I want to win. For the amount of elixir I'm committing. Hog Rider, I'm gonna get rid of my light. This time I'm gonna light, no matter what. There we go, and we're gonna hit that Inferno Tower too. And we're gonna take out the Electro Wizard, and the Hog's gonna get a hit. So now, if I log and I light, then that should be game right there. So now I just have to focus on defense. I'm gonna play a Boulder right there. We're gonna play that right there, so I'm gonna play an Ice Spirit, I'm playing this with here. And I just need the lightning, so I'm just gonna forget about it. Don't forget about it, fish. That's a good game to this guy. That is good game right there. Good luck. Good. I think that's a BM good luck, but that's okay. So we're gonna be playing one more in this game, right? In this in this classic challenge right here. We're gonna be playing one more against this guy. So I don't have a really good starting hand. I got my three spells and I got a bowler. So bowler's good on defense though. So now I'm just gonna make him I'm just gonna let him play first. He's gonna play Goblin Barrel, so actually I'm gonna activate the King Tower with the Actually I played that a little bit too late and on the right spot. So I couldn't activate the King Tower, so I took some free damage pretty much. Ah, I don't want to log that. I don't. I do not want to log that. Because I know he has his Goblin Barrel. So we're pretty much playing a bait there. Another Infernal Tower, but it's good that he played it earlier. So that's really good. And he, he should have Rocker. So let's be careful when I place my troops. Hopefully my Hog my next card. Yeah, there we go. So I'm just going to let that Infernal die. And then I'm going to play Ice Spirit. I'm not gonna log that princess right there. That's slug. That one's still gonna work for should die though. I'm gonna put a boy right there to take out that knight. If we were to send a golem barrel, we would have been in a little bit of trouble. Yeah, we would have been in a little bit of trouble, but that's okay right there. We're gonna take that. I'm just gonna send a golem barrel. This time, I will activate the king tower. Because the other time, I didn't play close enough to the king tower. So now we were, we were able to take it out. And that dark golem, I'm just gonna play an ice spirit. There we go. It still got three shots on. Surprisingly enough. Uh, I'm just gonna play Musketeer. I'm gonna send a Hog Rider right there to keep the pressure up. Hopefully, he doesn't have Inferno Rotation. How did he have so much Elixir? Man. He has so much Elixir right now. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm gonna log that right there. It's gonna hit the uh, knight too, so he's not gonna get any damage on the top. So that was good. That was a good trade. I don't know what his heavy spell is though, because normally he has a heavy spell in this kind of deck. It's kind of bait deck. He's doing a good bit of damage though. Actually, I'm gonna be able to let him. Right there. The hog rider. I'm gonna get rid of my wall. right there to hit that tower that. And Inferno and take out that princess. How can we get two hits? First time we got two hits all game. I'm gonna play a boulder right there. Uh, he's not gonna play anything else, so I'm gonna play an ice spirit. I think he meant to play on the other lane, but he misplayed. So that's okay for that. But they're gonna be doing nothing. The Inferno start getting my big dragon, so it's great. I'm not lightning right there. Ah, but that that Gong gang is gonna do a good job. He doesn't seem to have a heavy spell though, so that's good. That ball, if I get some, if you get some shots off, that's gonna be good. There we go. Oh, that was that was a slow log. A little bit of lag right there. That was unfortunate. That was a really laggy game right there at the end. But that's okay though. We could have won that, but yeah, that, we lagged that right there. At the end. So here's the deck, guys. It's a very good deck as you guys could have seen, we went 3-1, we should have went 4-0 oh right there because we could have took out that, uh, that Goblin Barrel, but we sort of lo uh, lagged a little bit with the lock, but that's okay. So here's the deck guys, if you guys like it, copy it, use it, 
And thank you guys for watching. If you guys liked the video, leave a like, subscribe, and leave in the comments below different uh, decks I could use in different video ideas. Thank you guys for watching. This has been 